The Babylonian, Egyptian, Indian, and Chinese civilizations are the oldest civilizations in human history. But only the Chinese civilization still exists today. Why? In the 1980s, after terror of the Cultural Revolution ended, an economic reform project was launched in China. In 2010, China became the second largest economy. What happened? How can that be? Ancient Chinese culture has basic respect for human nature and establishes a moral outlook based off benevolence and righteousness. Ancient Chinese culture originated from the Western Zhou Dynasty, maturing in the Spring and Autumn period. In the history of China, the Spring and Autumn period are the most active and glorious era of Talking Poetry. Many famous philosophers in Chinese history were born in this area, and they are often referred to as a hundred schools of thought. One of these philosophers is Confucius, who contributed the most to the ancient Chinese culture. Confucius proposed benevolence and rights as core moral thoughts, as seen in one of his sayings, do not impose on others what you do not wish for. Confucius proposed benevolence and rights as core moral thoughts, as seen in one of his sayings, do not impose on others what you do not wish for. Confucius proposed benevolence and rights as core moral thoughts, as seen in one of his sayings, do not impose on others what you do not wish for. Confucius proposed benevolence and rights as core moral thoughts, as seen in one of his sayings, do not impose on others what you do not wish for. Confucius proposed benevolence and rights as core moral thoughts, as seen in one of his sayings, do not impose on others what you do not wish for. Confucius proposed benevolence and rights as core moral thoughts, as seen in one of his sayings, do not impose on others what you do not wish for.